I would think from the standpoint of stress, we would talk about uh, a molecule called CRF, which is produced by hypo the hypothalamus, which causes ACTH to be released by the pituitary gland, which goes to the adrenals and causes cortisol to be produced by the adrenal cortex. We also have uh, gonadotropin uh, releasing hormone, a, a hypothalamic a hormone from the brain, which causes the release of the gonadotropic hormones from the pituitary, which causes the production of sex hormones by the, uh, uh, by the gonads, by the ovaries and testes. But then we also have cytokines, which are products of, uh, related to the immune system, which have uh, uh, functions in inflammation and, and also in mounting an immune response. But they also actually are produced in small amounts in the brain itself. Uh, and, and even circulating uh, inflammatory molecules can signal back into the brain as well. Just as the sex hormones and cortisol can also signal back to the brain.